cardiopulmonary resuscitation, CPR. 1. Assess the response. If the victim didn't respond to the verbal and painful stimuli, he's unconscious. 2. Call for help 997. Before starting the CPR, you have to do the following. Make sure that the patient is breathing spontaneously for 3-5 seconds through. Look to the movement of the victim's chest. Listen to the breath sounds. Feel the air while it's coming out from victim's mouth. Then check the pulse at the neck, in the groove between Adam's apple and the muscle on the side of the neck, for 10 seconds. 3. Start the CPR, CAB. C. Compressions. With both of your hands, compress on the middle of the victim's chest, as shown in the picture, in depth of 5 cm for adults and 4 cm for children for at least 100 compressions per minute at rate of minus 30 compressions followed by 2 breaths for adults and children in the presence of one rescuer. 15 compressions followed by 2 breaths for children in the presence of two rescuer. A. Airway. Open the airway by one of the following. Head tilt and chin lift in the absence of spinal injury. As shown in the picture. Jaw thrust in case of spinal injury. As shown in the picture. B. Breathing. Give the victim two rescue breaths after each 30 compressions for adults and children in the presence of one rescuer. And after 15 compressions for children, in the presence of two rescuers. Each breath should be for one second and one second in between two breaths to get the air out of the chest, with full chest recoil. Make sure that the nose is closed.